This is an equation from Goodwill Hunting. I'm not gonna pretend I know what this equation means because it was supposed to be really complicated, but to me, it looks more like chemistry than math. But the point of this is, is there's the main character in Goodwill Hunting, his name was Will Hunting. And Will was a natural prodigy in math. He was super good at retaining information. He was, he was self-taught. He'd read books and borrow books from the library. At the beginning of the movie, you saw him just standing there or sitting in his room with a huge pile of books. And even though his, he would have been considered a hoodlum or whatever, he was really, really smart. Well, Will was a janitor at a really, really high-end school. And at the school, they had an equation like this on the board. And basically, the professor assigned anyone, uh, like a, extra credit or something, to anybody who was able to sign the equation. And he signed, a, he, he was able to do the equation super fast. And after he did the equation, they like hunted him down and like figured out like what, who this guy was. And eventually they were able to get different like math professors to kind of help him unlock his potential. And he ended up being like a super influential like mathematician. But how does that apply to you? Because I feel like most of us aren't natural protégés of math. But like Will, we all have been spending our entire lives collecting information. And specifically that information lies in experiences because AI and technology, that's the one th major thing that it lacks in as far as writing and producing content is gaining experience and learning from those experiences. So how can we use our personal experiences to make our writing more persuasive, more engaging, but still use the effective tools we have with AI. So today we're gonna to be spending 90 minutes writing a persuasive, persuasive essay. In this persuasive essay, we will be able to take some of our stories and apply them. You're gonna be picking one of your favorite stories about yourself from your life and apply it to be able to convince someone of to buy a product, to invest in your company, or to hire you. It doesn't really matter what you write about because this isn't necessarily a writing assignment. It's more of proving and learning how to use AI tools. So in this assignment, we're going to be using three AI tools. And each of those tools does one of three things. The first thing is ideation. Now it can be really hard and a real burden in a lot of assignments to come up with your topic. Sometimes it's the thing that takes the longest is coming up with a good topic and it can make all the difference on whether or not your paper is good and, or whether it's not based on if it's a topic that you feel passionate about. So ideation with AI makes it so that AI can look at all of these new news articles. It can look at everything popular about your topic and it can pick something that is the hottest right now that will for sure be successful and that cuts down a lot of your time. The second thing is your sources. Sources through AI makes it so that you can gain tons of like evidence and data supporting your claim, so long as your claim is a legitimate claim, and it will make it so much easier to make your assignment legit, like just legit, super solid paper. And the third thing is grammar. The grammar makes it like we can give ourselves a strong rough draft by the end of this assignment instead of worrying about do I put a comma here or do I need to make a change here. The, gr the grammar based on AI is super effective and it's a great tool to help us learn how to do grammar so that when we write in the future, you just write in the right grammar. It's worked for me, I know it'll work for you. So that's it class, today we're just gonna be writing for the next 90 minutes and I want a paper by the end of class. And basically the whole point of this assignment is to learn how to use these tools. Don't worry about how good your paper is. I'm not looking for literary expertise in 90 minutes. 